So as you guys know, Blast has been revealed recently in One Punch Man and really appeared to be someone truly powerful. And I think his power level really can rival Saitama's and even be ahead of it. His various ability constitute a big benefit for him because as we know, Saitama don't have any other special abilities such as laser beam or dimensional traveling or so. So we haven't seen Blast in the anime yet, but at least in the manga, Already we can estimate how powerful he is, taking into account various facts. The fact that he is able to carry around the mysterious cube which proved to be very heavy, heavy enough to cause Flashy Flashy Arm to get stuck under it. And also the fact that Blast killed a giant monster which has a massive hole inside its torso, pretty much looking like a damage from a point similar to Saitama. Saitama can defeat anyone with a single punt and I think Blast can do it too. So the big question here is that uh, can he defeat uh, Ultra Instant Goku? We know that Ultra Instant Goku is very powerful in such way that anytime Goku goes into Ultra Instant, he immediately outclasses his opponent. For example, his battle with Jiren, you guys know how stuff went there. Although if Goku is in Ultra Instant, he might be able to handle or take down blast ultra instinct technique is very hard to master a significant part of the difficulty comes with the technique massive stamina drain for someone who has not trained enough can be able to maintain it for long right and also another level of ultra instinct is the fact that goku could be using ultra instinct in his base form according to some dragon ball chapter uh Goku could be able to do that, you see, so that's crazy. I'm literally hearing by there that Goku could be able to be like on um, angel level. However, could that be enough to take down blasts from One Punch Man? It is kind of hard to say, so let me know in the comments below what you really think, and then subscribe and like, and I'll see you later on another video. Thanks.